What's going on, my dudes? Welcome back. We're gonna take this Clackbridge troll because that dude is a beast. Uh, actually, it's not a beast; it's a troll. So you could not sack it to a creature like Ravenous Bailoff. I think I'm getting sick. I mentioned this before, but now we're recording, so I'm gonna tell you. I think I'm getting sick. My throat has been hurting, and every time I want to go do something, I'm like, "Oh, I'm gonna go stream," and then I lay down for a second and I just pass out for two hours, and it's been brutal. So I took a bunch of, I took some Dayquil. Oh, I need to get a shit pack like that. Ooh, charm sleep, actually. All right. You want some dope? I actually, this morning I woke up and my stomach was killing me. So I took some of the Pepto that you got me last time, funny enough. And then, oh, baked into a pie? Oh, yes. We're doing it. We are doing it. And then Katie sent me uh, chicken noodle soup and a bread bowl for lunch. And I was just like, man, my friends are amazing. I'm literally sustaining myself with the generosity of you people. And it's very nice. What did you say? I can't hang right now, but I remind you that you still have me a sing-along draft. <laughs> Japoshi, it's definitely in my list of things. I promise you that. Uh, no soda on the side. Uh, some Sunny D, actually. It burned my throat. Maybe that's the problem. Yeah, I just don't know what's wrong, because I'm not feverish. I don't have, like, a fever. Like, my nose isn't running. It's literally just I feel exhausted and my throat hurts. That's pretty much it. So. I don't know, man. This pack's pretty bad. We could just take Cauldron's Gift to give us more clack bridge trolls. You want some super brand cereal? You can blow out your... I thought this. I thought wasn't this, wasn't this hero called Colin Blot? Wasn't there wasn't there a skit about Colin Blot? Oh, Tomb Raider. Okay, we're doing it. Do I like Tomb Raider better than Lockthwain Paladin? Yeah, I think so. Fantress Paladin. So many Paladins. Do I just want Cauldron familiar? This guy's not very good, right? Finally done. I packed up all my vape stuff and it finally quit smoke. Mitch, that's awesome, dude. I'm super proud of you, my man. Way to go, buddy. Way to go. It's 2019. Nobody smokes anyway. It's all over now. I'll take this guy. I've never taken this cat before. I think if we can get it back, it's pretty nice. And we have food here. And... Well, they're getting some food here. Mitch, congratulations. Seriously, dude, that's awesome. <whistles> Wham. Bam. Alakazam. Well, well, well. Malevolent Noble. Ooh, that guy's really good. No, just kidding. He's not very good at all. It's definitely one of these two. I think this is 2 4 and this is 4 and has actually been fine for me, especially with Vigilance. Especially when there's like an artifact sub theme a little bit. You should draft one of your, one of them Oko cards. I hear it's good. Oh god, didn't even get me started. I think I'm going to talk about that tonight in my article. Trying this healthy living stuff, gluten free, smoke free. We'll see how it plays out. Well, hopefully, hopefully you do well. I think we're just taking Cauldron here. Cauldron actually has become quite respectable to me. Oh, Sage of the Falls. Ooh, well, okay. Well, is this a knight? No, it's not a knight troll, so we can't get back with Barrow Witches. 
Hey, Selena, it has been great so as to pass the time while at work. Glad to hear it, buddy. Glad to hear it, Aaron. Unexplained vision or opt? Eh, I'm, I just don't like opt, but we already have three five drops. I'll take the opt, I guess. God, I'm not thrilled with it. I was shown to today that Garenberg Squire is young Barack Obama, and now I cannot see that. Just figured I <laughs> uh, passed that along. I I literally said that in stream. Did you not? Did you not get that from here? If you guys remember, I totally said, I was like, this is just young Barack Obama, right? It's definitely documented in some draft video. Oko is right. I don't know. Oko, Oko angry face is right. Zimini Pot, I totally understand. I was just saying that, like, I definitely made that young Barack Obama reference. So it's kind of, it was kind of funny. Uh, yeah, whatever. I'm not going to play Hinge Walker. I think our next looking pretty good so far. Some of these packs have been meh. Like this guy, or this guy, or this guy, and this guy, but... <clears throat> whatever, I'll take a turtle. Not gonna love it. Not gonna hate it. I got a new job, so I can't watch the afternoon streams. These, oh, nice. I'm glad that uh, it's it's mostly been just because my schedule's messed up more than anything. It's not really like, uh, oh, that's not an Oko. Hmm, Sir Conrad the Grim, or Covetous Urge. Oh, young Barack Obama. I don't know if your dies or creature cross put a grave anywhere other than the battlefield or creature leaves your graveyard. It deals one damage. This guy's very good. This is good too, though. I think this is more likely to come back, to be quite honest. Yeah, I'm going to take Conrad. I like another Tome Raider. <coughs> I like it over Tempting Witch or Lost, Le Lost Legion. It's also easier to cast. Oh, another charm sleep. Yes. Excellent. <laughs> Semi charm kind of sleep. Uh, I mean, the <clears throat> driver's license verification took on mana traders. <clears throat> I have no idea. I feel like I should though. Scorching Dragonfire is great. Savvy Hunter is great. Resolute Rider is great. Unfortunately, none of them are in our colors. Mystic Sanctuary, just to get back a bacon and pie, is pretty good. Oh man. It's so sad having to pass these like top tier cards though. Reaper, I guess, is fine. I'll just take the Reaper. Not thrilled about it, but. Sure, and they're usually pretty responsive uh, as to <clears throat> as to emails and stuff, so they should get back to you within a day at least. Wow, double Savvy Hunter. Wow, that's really insane. I guess I'll take the Witching Well and pass someone a double Savvy Hunter. I'm sure they deserve it.
I'm sure they worked hard for it. <clears throat> when you play any other other world stream, probably tonight. I'm gonna play some magic, then I'm gonna play some our worlds, and then I'm gonna write my article, and it's gonna be a long night. <clears throat> Oh, it's run away together. Run away together, never coming back. Uh, that's our first two drop. That's something. I would love a witch's coven. Oven? Witch's oven. My bad. Oh, that's this is this will help get that witch's oven. Look at this inspiring veteran. Do you start out with a monetary cap or do you pay for different tiers on mana traders? Uh there's different subscription uh, levels you have to pay for. So depending on how much you want to rent. <coughs> I just found my friend for one on soldier tokens. Do I have so many of those still? from my TCG player days. Uh, Wicked Guardian could be good. Maybe. Maybe not. It does hit all these. Yeah, what the hell, it's an extra card. We're not gonna be playing Sorcerer's Spyglass, so. Thank you. Oh God, it's almost been two years. What have I done with my life? God, well, I hope, <clears throat> I hope more than this, buddy. Ben, thank you so much, dude. I appreciate you. Uh, this pack seems bad. I don't want a second one of either of these. I'm just gonna take this guy. I'm gonna deny someone a sweet ass OK Ranger. I have a ton of Frank Soldier. Uh. Aaron, I can send them out with the... I'll send them out with the Bayou. I'll put some in the in the envelope. Oh, Tempting Witch is fine. It's not great. Joust is nice. Gingerbread's nice. Oh, goodness gracious. It's probably just... Eh, maybe it's Witch. Eh, we'll take the Witch's Cottage. I can see playing it because we can get our Clackbridge troll back. Someone did buy the bayou. Okay. I'll take it. <coughs> we have a whole other pack after this? Man. Son of a biscuit. I mean, I'm pretty sure it's just bog naughty here. I don't think there's anything else even close. Is there a Billy in that? <laughs> Bo the Adventures of Bayou Billy. Remember that game? You guys remember that game on like... I don't even think it was any... I think it was just regular NES. <clears throat> I think I like Vandal better than Falmire Knight, especially with Double Tome Raider. God, Magic Mirror? Always so late, dude. No one wants Magic Mirror, but I don't either, so I'm gonna take this Hypnotic Sprite. <sighs> Should've got more to drink. <clears throat> oh, Bacon Noob High number two? <clears throat> Probably better than Frogify. It also makes a food, so it goes well with our kitty cat. Alright, deck is picking up. Deck is picking up. Magic, does Magic Mirror just kill you unlimited? Yeah, that's my concern. I don't think you could win fast enough. I don't even know how I got these. They're in a hard protector. The net says, thanks, Mr. Hardfrey. <laughs> that's funny. <clears throat> there was a, I did a GoFundMe back in like 2017 for like my AC in my car because I literally couldn't, like I just didn't have the extra cash for it at the time because it was right after a move and I was like 
I'm just spent. So you might have actually helped me with that. And I know I sent things out for that. But I don't know. Could have been anything, really. Frogify, so tiny. It's got to be Frogify, right? We have 14 creatures. Don't din say please. Yeah, I'll take a counterspell. Yeah, you can't find a secret keeper on here, my dude. Shut up and take my money. Oh, okay. One back in time air conditioning book. <laughs> well, the funny thing is my AC is broken again, so anything you guys want to donate for my AC again, you're more than welcome to do so. I think it's the event the first time I had to get my condenser replaced, and that worked. Now I think I have to get my I think it's the evaporator. Yeah, I think it's the evaporator, which is going to be like probably like a thousand bucks, which is super fun. This, these, this, these packs have been great so far. Another frogify. Going down to the witching well. Why didn't he say that? We're not going down there. I'll just take this removal spell. Now we have cuts to make. Misford River Turtle, you can go. I'm sorry, Misford River Turtle. I do like all these five drops. Oh, wow. Mystical Dispute came back. So did Legion. Lost Legion. I'll take the counter spell. I like having counter spells in this format. Two more. Do we just get rid of Cauldron Familiar? I don't think he's that great. I'm going to take the Mythic. What the hell? Wow, Magic Mirror came back. That's crazy. That's crazy. All right, well, our deck has it all now. Wow, Mystic Sanctuary, um, uh, a Queen of Ice, and a... I think the Queen of Ice might be better than Lost Legion here. I think it's just way more versatile and easier to cast. <coughs> this is actually more of a three drop. Just moved to a colder place. How far did you make it in Outer Worlds? I ended up passing out before the end of your stream. Uh, we had to make the decision between Edgewater and uh, the Deserters. We had to figure out which one we were going to redirect the power to. We chose Edgewater, unfortunately. Or fortunately, I don't know. I think this looks good. I'll play this, and I'll probably play this. None of these are card advantage, which is unfortunate. But we have two baked into pies. Actually, maybe I don't want that. I just want the... I don't want to get my Clackbridge troll back. Yeah, 8-8 eight, eight seems fine. Actually, you probably want... Hmm. Eh, I definitely want more blue. Yeah, we did a coin flip for it because I was like, I don't know, dude. I have no idea. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Yeah, it's 8, 9. Okay. <coughs> Shut up and take my money. What's happening? Let's get Frank a new AC. <laughs> Good lord, man. Oh, God. It's just been one thing after another. Like, first my AC goes out in 2016, and I'm like, okay, that's fine. So I get a new compressor put in, and it's like 1200 bucks or something ridiculous. It's so expensive. And then it starts working again for a bit. And then, like, just recently, maybe like a, two months ago, um, my... Let's hold on, let me see what it was called. Like, it just starts blowing hot again, and I'm like, what the fuck? And also, my car was, like, overheating. So, that was from my, the inverter pump. My inverter pump broke, and that was another 300 bucks. And now, <clears throat> and then I went in, and he was like, I think it's your evaporator. I put it, I sealed the leak. So, we're going to see if that fixes it. We got to just, uh, we'll, we'll try that for now and see if it works, right? So, it worked for a while. It worked. They sealed the he sealed the evaporator leak, and it worked up until my inverter pump died. And then once the inverter pump died, I got that replaced. So the evaporator was uh, 
the evaporator leak was 100, 120 bucks to fix. And then <clears throat> the inverter pump was 300 bucks. But after the, the inverter pump died, the AC was hot again. And I was like, why is this connected? I don't understand. So now I think it's just, I think I just have to get the evaporator fixed at some point if I want to actually drive with AC. So it's funny because my car cost me like 6,000 <clears> and I, all things, all things done, I'm probably going to have replaced like 3,000 in parts after every, after everything's said and done with the AC and the evaporator pump. I also I also spent 700 bucks on a new hybrid battery and I spent like 160 bucks on a new 12 volt battery recently. So like I put a t so much money in my car, dude. <clears throat> Why didn't you get the whole system replaced the first time? I don't know how you mean. Um Priuses have like two separate like I mean I don't know if, if all cars do but like Priuses have like why didn't I play this first turn because I'm like in the middle of my story that's why okay seven hundred was pretty cheap it was a it was a it was a re it was a renewed battery like a recharged battery that had um that had a three year warranty so I was like that's pretty good <clears throat> so the three year warranty really like sold it for me. Um, but as far as getting the whole system replaced, like, I didn't think I had to at the time. Like it just, we just thought it was the compressor the first time. So like, and the AC worked again after we got the compressor fixed. So I'm just going to block here. Hmm. Well, I guess it's your turn. And that's, this has been car talk with Frank. <clears throat> maybe they don't have a fourth land either are we playing are we playing stream viewer terror right now because that's pretty funny okay well that's something all right Car talk with Frank consists of me talking about my problems with my car and you guys telling me how to fix it or what's best for it. Yep. That's pretty good. Dude, I, I messaged Andrew and I'm like, when are we recording? He never responded. So I don't even know if friends is still a thing anymore. Every time I do a podcast with someone, that person literally just disappears and stops putting in the initiative to record the podcast. And it's kind of old. I'm kind of just over podcasting. <clears throat> okay we're getting somewhere no card to be drawn here but that's okay I mean our hand is three removal spells and a bouncy spell so you got to accentuate the positive everybody be -be -de -be -de. Twenty hundred dollars, Jesus God. That's that's amazing. Yep. Trail of Crumbs is so good, dude. Another curious pair, huh? Should have done that last turn. Then you can play that curious pair. You have the type of voice that's easy to listen to, and you should do a podcast by yourself just about your day. And I was literally—I used to do stuff like that for Patreon. <clears throat> it was called Frank Thoughts, and I would just talk for like fifteen minutes about my thoughts. Mm hmm. 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 They did not play this guy. <coughs> Fascinating. You got to accentuate the positive, eliminate the negative. <laughs> That's not worth 700 tire, my dude. <laughs> Oh, Jesus.
All right. It's all right. It's all good. All right. Oh, you're hasting it up here, huh? That's aggressive. One, two, three, four, five, six. <coughs> I'll take six. That seems fine. Oh, it would definitely cost you more than 2800 to buy half of a vintage deck. That's for sure. Maybe we just keep baking a pie up. Yeah, I like that. What do you think of the new standard? I dislike it greatly. And I have no desire to play it. I hope they don't have a uh, Veil of Summer. Doesn't look like it. <clears throat> oh, that's pretty good. Yeah, it just feels like it's a mono elk format. Elks for days. And I'm just like, nod. I'm like bog naughty. <clears throat> the Mandalorian does look sweet. I haven't seen any trailer yet. Uh-oh, big tree, man. One, two, three, four, five. Okay. Wow, you just reeve sold my bog naughty? That's the rudest thing you could do. It's not interactive for me. I don't think there's enough answers for... Um, For Oko. Like, I just don't think there's enough answers for the card. I, there's there's not enough ways to deal with a turn two Planeswalker in Standard. And that's just the, that's just the bottom line. <clears throat> Gotta accentuate the positive. Um, let's get rid of this guy. I guess we're going to get rid of both, right? Look at all this food I'm making. It's delicious. Charmed sleep. Don't you wake up. MLG ELK instead of ELD. That's great. If you're feeling down about the current standard format, just pick me up, put me down, put my feet back. What is that from? I don't even know what that is. Joke's on you. You can't trick me with this song. I don't even know what it is. Oh, they're just going to kill us immediately? That's pretty brutal. Wow, and they have nine mana, so they get to... Jesus. Well, that's unfortunate. How about a Clackbridge troll? That'd be nice. It's Coco Jambo. Oh my god, dude. Oh my god. <clears throat> Boy. Where are my creatures? I've seen three creatures so far. Do they play Forest? Alright, so we know about this swamp. They have one card that we don't know about. That's pretty good.
I'll take one. And I'll crack this food. Show me the way to Pioneer? Dude, I got like, I put like four videos, four Pioneer videos up so far on YouTube. Alright, well, that guy's decent with these two. Oh, God. Tap you down. Do, 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 do. Frogify. Do, 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 do. You can eat that guy, but then it just goes under the other guy, so. I'm okay with it. Two cards to two cards. You know, one of your cards is that swamp that we just saw. Is it possible for me to get a creature? Okay. Wishing well. <clears throat> Let's pitch this. Play this. Um, bottom you and top you. I'm okay with that. Because next time we can keep up all the things. Okay. Red mana. <laughs> okay. Well, that was cute. I should have held that, but I think we're all right. <coughs> Baby shark. Because we can actually double block this. Oh, you're attacking with the 1 1 2. Interesting. Okay, you're not attacking with anything. Worked out well for us. Um. Hmm. Get rid of Queen of Ice, I guess. That's it's your boy. Okay, I feel like we're doing better here. <clears throat> we do have to start getting in there, though. So we're going to do that. Okay, I think we've I think we've turned the corner as they say. One, two, three, four. So they could actually block here. So I guess we'll just get in there for one. Oh, uh, I don't know if I'm actually playing any Pioneer tonight. We'll see. I have no idea. I just haven't been feeling good, and I think Draft is the most, like... It's the it's the most... It's a, it's a format I don't have to focus on as much as Pioneer. Like, I don't have to think about, like, 10,000 cards, and which ones I should put in, or which one I should take out, or why, or... I just think Draft is just easier on my brain at this moment. Oh, Savvy Hunter. Wow. Well, I was gonna... <clears throat> oh, no, we have Hypnotic Sprite. That's fantastic. Thrilled I am, yes. Does this mean lose life, gain life? Oh, it just deals one damage. Okay. I hope I start for later. I don't even know what's wrong. I just, like, been <clears throat> drained all day. And we get to draw, trigger this guy, discard the island. 
seems good. Um, yeah, that one's fine. This guy gets bigger. Get in there for four. Shut up and take my money. Oh, whose money we taking? Hope you feel better soon. <laughs> DPO, thank you so much, man. Really appreciate it. Really appreciate it. The five feel better bucks. <clears throat> Main. I'm going to play the land here because I do want to go frogify and keep up the witch. So now we have no cards. But we can deal them three from the witch, three from the witch, and then kill them next turn with Fairy Vandal. Presuming they don't. Okay, we win the game. Our deck got off to a very, very slow start there, but still did okay. So. I think we're fine. I don't really see anything. You probably caught it from me. I'm sorry. I forgive you. Dang it, Juposhi. <clears throat> baby shark. Why is baby shark stuck in my head? Nobody knows. Because this is my life. <clears throat> <sighs> because baby shark Loki slaps yeah it's a banger man what is baby shark oh my goodness oh my goodness Josie come on Um, you know what? I'm going to keep this hand. If we hit lands, I think we're in, in good shape. And this into this is great. <clears throat> I'm a fan of that. Uh... Okay. One more land. <clears throat> Ideally an island. Let me see that island. Show us an island. Can a dude get an island one time? Look at this hasty boy. Oh dang, they're going to make food. Oh. Their glorious and friendship is magic. I was actually really tempted to get those. I like all those magic promos that are not like, they're not like legal, but they're like I got the I have the, <clears throat> I have the ones from like PAX a few years ago. I think it was PAX, where like one is the uh, one is a transformer, one is a D and D card, and one is something else. Those are sweet. <clears throat> friendship is magic. You ain't kidding. This is an aggressive turn. I'm just taking six here. Hopefully they're out of gas now. Be out of gas. We need one more land. I mean, I'm at 12. I'm done taking your I'm take I'm done taking your abuse. <clears throat> oh dang it every time this card's good so is our card though so that's pretty cool so they're gonna go EOT food that's pretty good I didn't even know there was a dragon token in there Man, I've been living my life like a fool. Oh, 
All right, I think we uh, once like once we get this much mana in this board, like it's kind of board presence. I think we're like we're I think we're in the clear. Did they hit? What did they hit? Tempting Witch. All right, so that's gone. Yeah, use that ability for sure. Play this thing. Wither Witching Well. Give me that clack draw draw bridge troll. I like that they get goats, not food with the with the troll. Oh, God, Thank you. I'm just gonna take both of these, right? Maybe. Nifty Chris, 19 months, and what do you get? Another month older and deeper in debt. <laughs> Saint Moochel, don't you call me because I can't go. I owe my sub debt. <laughs> oh, God, Chris, I love you, dude. I want to put both of these on top. I think they're both very, very good to have. My man. Christopher McGee. Somebody once told me the world is gonna roll me. I'm not the sharpest Chris in the chat. <clears throat> I think your last name is McGee. Christopher Furterer McGee. What is this other badge you have? Good luck, have fun pledge. God, you are the... Chris, you are the most wholesome, wonderful person I know. And I love you. I ain't afraid to say it. I'll say it right here. I love you. I love you. Okay. That dude's a five five. He's gonna be like, haste them all up. No haste them all up. All right. <clears throat> I think I'm gonna just take five here. I got a food here, a food here, a kill spell here, an ice lady. I can just block. That seems worse though, right? Now let's go to seven. I said, yeah. What a concept. I could use good luck to have fun myself. And we could all use a little change. Well, the Chris starts coming and they don't stop coming. Okay, what are we are we gonna are we gonna loot here? Yes, because it could be a land. Oh we made a mistake. That's just terrible. I gotta get rid of Charm Sleep. That's the only, uh... I'm just gonna play this. I'd rather have the creature on the board than have, like, one of these idiots tapped. Well, the kids start coming and they're not coming. Wow, did you just outmuscle my Sir Conrad? What an actual scumbag. Oh, you don't want to come at me? I mean I could just I have I have another two five I can just block with. Oh, clacky boy. The pipes, the pipes are calling. There you go, get some goats. Now we will, because we can discard a land. We got four, five, six, seven, eight. You could tr you could triple block with everybody. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yeah, that's actually pretty good. I'm game for that attack. <clears throat> okay. Huh. Go for me to four. You are going to put me to four. Oh, man. I definitely feel like... I definitely feel sick. <clears throat> oh, that's pretty good. Oh, that just kills us. That's amazing. Wow. <laughs> wow. 
Wow. Let's let maybe they don't see it. Wow, that's insane. Yep, they saw it. It's pretty brutal. It's funny because if we kept up a land, we could actually, uh. Yep. Cool. Well, that was sad. And not terribly fun. Unfortunately. I feel like that was our fault, but whatever. What are you going to do? <laughs> do we have 17 lands in the deck? <clears throat> Sometimes it's hard to tell from hands like these. I guess I'll keep this. Come on, island. One island off the top. Let's quit kind of sub should I make myself for dinner. Sweet onion chicken teriyaki, my dude. And then toss a cookie in that bitch. Alright. I think this is a great recovery to six, but... We'll see if we can ever hit a fifth land. Make a food. Nope, just paladin. Okay. A Garen Brick Squire. Come on. You can do it. Land. Frogify. <clears throat> Frogify now. Guess we could have attacked with Tome Raider there. What a dumb thing not to do. This is where they play the wolf. You're guaranteed to hit a land if you play a sick Yu-Gi-Oh! top deck soundbite. Wow, that's pretty... That's good to know. If you're going to attack this turn, why not just attack last turn? Sure. Okay. Come on, land. One time. <sighs> Like, it's a lot to ask. I understand. Do I toast the cookie or put it on after? Uh, you break it in half and put put half of it on each side of the six inch. Man, every game with trailer crumbs. That's brutal. Are you also missing a fifth land, my friend? Looks like it. All right, well. Look at these hasty boys. I'm not going to waste the bacon to a pie on these two one threes. So. Pump that fist. Crack that whip. This is nice and early for this Clackbridge troll. Not even if they're hasty one threes? No, not even then.
Crack that whip. Burner. Wow, really? They just never want to. They just never want to. But do I toast it? That's a good question. I actually did not answer that, did I? They know this guy has trample, right? So they took seven and blocked with a goat. So they could have sacked a goat, right? And then they, I would have gained three and drawn a card. They took seven instead. So if someone said like, hey, would you rather have your opponent draw a card and gain three life or you take seven damage? They were like, I'd rather take seven. That's crazy to me. Garen Brig Paladin. Oh, Bog Naughty. Well, that thing's getting... We're going to pie that thing up. When something comes along, you must whip it. Now whip it. Into shape. Well, we definitely want to kill this immediately. So. And then I'm probably just tagging with this. She can't block anything. If they play Fierce fierce Stalker, or whatever the card is, the 4-4 Wolf with Haste, or with Trample, like, well, I'm not going to block that. If they play, um... If they play Garenberg Paladin, I can't block that. So there's really no... No incentive that I can see currently for attacking with Tome Raider. at this particular juncture. I might actually refill my drink after this round. Correct. That w this guy is just un unbelievably good. And now we have two. Now whip it into shape. Shape it up. I'm going to hold that for next turn so we can discard it to Sage of the Falls. We don't need a sixth land here. Although, our seventh land, although we could have played bacon into a pie. Chocolate chip or raspberry cheesecake cookie? I'm a big chocolate chip fan. Pepper Jack cookie. Get a Pepper Jack meatball cookie. It's delicious. Double. Oh, now it all makes sense. Wow. The trail of crumbs makes so much more sense now. The trail of crumbs every game is really making sense now. So many witches. Play your other trail of crumbs. There you go. That's gone. Did you play a forest? You did. So now you have three foods. You're not going to crack any of them this turn, I don't imagine. <clears throat> Sweet trail of crumbs. Ba -ba -da. Thank you. St Standard beat. Thank you so much for the reset, buddy. Welcome back. Welcome Mick Backerson. Let's just get in there. I feel like you're gonna you're gonna sacrifice something here. Yep, okay. Good times never felt so good. We're at twenty three. Jesus. How is this card real? <laughs> One, two, three, four, five. Play you. Oh yes. Um, see, now we're talking. Now we got a solid game plan. Three removal spells in hand. We're at 23 life. We can Reaper of the Night next turn. This is good, though. They do get to find two things. That's a good one. Can't play it this turn, though, which is good. And land. Or Curious Pair. Those are my guesses. Land or Curious Pair. Trample. 
Trailer comes whenever you sack a food or whenever you, it's whenever you sack a food. So you can sack it for any reason. You can just sack it the tempting witch. Reaper of souls. Yikes. Okay, squire. Yeah, we're probably just gonna Reaper of Night. <laughs> Did I say Reaper of Souls? I meant Reaper of Night. I don't know why I said that. <laughs> Reaper of... <clears throat> That's the name of the card, right? That's the official name? So Reaper and they, those are the, yikes. Yeah, I'm probably just keeping up Baked in a Pie now. Bake, I call it Baked in a Pie, it's Bake into a Pie, but the way I say it is just easier. How are these the two worst cards in your hand? That's surprising to me. I am literally toasting cooking a Teraki sub right now. I have evolved to the next level of sub. No, you're not, dude. No way. No, stop it, dude. Dude, this is just a meme. You're not supposed to really do it. Oh, God. Think of your employees who are supposed to be who you're supposed to be a role model to. Somebody please think of the children. Yeah, you definitely need to link us to a picture. Like, that's not even... You can't not do that. Oh my god, they just keep dying. Sweet little bees. We have 16 cards left. I think we're doing alright. This costs 7 to play. I think we actually just Witch's Cottage for no value. Uh, I'm going to nay to this because I don't really care about... Man, maybe I just put it on top anyway. I'm going to play Reaper of Night. And we're going to keep up a runaway together. I'm not going to loot here because there's no reason to. Sweet teriyaki. Ba, ba, ba. Put a cookie on that sub. Ooh. And they milled four. What did they mill? They milled a Rose Thorn Accolade, two lands, and a giant opportunity. So the best they can get is probably Paladin or Reaper of Night. It does not get haste, which is nice, but I don't really care if it did. We're at 29. It does get a counter, though. Bog naughty. Well, I'll be... I'm probably just going to frogify that. I don't want to charm sleep because they can still use the ability and then draw cards as well. Um, and I don't want to baked into a pie it because it's just not super relevant. So I'll frogify you.
You gonna, you gonna kill the Tomb Raider? Oh, you're gonna just neg five, neg five this guy. Interesting. Or neg three, neg three, rather. That's fine. And they're like, I'm not gonna sack now, I'll just block it because it's tiny. <sighs> one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. And you do have float, which is nice. So this is kind of delicious. I think I'm a monster. I bet you are a monster. <clears throat> See, this guy has trample, so if we're able to kill this guy, we should just win. That'll do. That'll do. I gave him the good games, buddy. Let's see if he chops in the hops in the chat. I just cast unexplained vision and drew three secret keepers to mill my opponent for the next twelve cards he had left. Oh god. Are you on arena or are you on MTGO? Oh, hold on. Let me refill my drink real quick. I'm gonna pause the recording so you guys will never know. Alright. Drink has been refilled. No one on YouTube is any of the wiser. And we're drinking these Sunny D packets that Kerwit bought us. On the one hand, it'll burn your throat. On the other hand, you can keep the one landers because of this witching well. It's pretty amazing. On the other hand, it has 100% vitamin C. So, Sammy, what's going on, my dude? Oh my god, Super Fritz, get it in there. Get in that Discord. Yeah, also, if you guys are subscribers, we have a subscriber Discord. Alright. Uh, bottom you and top you. Got one land. We can't do anything with it, but that's okay. Three drop into four drop? Into five drop? If we got three lands on top, we're good to go. Oh, we did it. <laughs> oh, I thought I'm out of vacation time, so I can't make it to Disney. There's always next year, though. Sammy. Always a good time, buddy. Always a good time. Have a good night, buddy. I'll block. Sure. <whistles> Michael bees, they live in trees. Well, this is a matchup where you really have to hit the land drops. Wow, they put a Rampart Smasher and a Lock Dragon in their graveyard. That's pretty hilarious with one mountain. And they have a an adamant guy that needs three mountains. So, like, I feel like their mountain uh, concentration is not ideal right now. 
Mountain concentration. You guys know that song from the Red Hot Chili Peppers? I have to draw some cards. Okay. If we can hit a black source, Trolley Boy could keep us in it. Mm, double black cards, not really where we're, we're looking for here. That is an island which I don't actually need, so we're going to ship the island. I think they're pushing it with two four mountain only cards in their black red deck. Yeah, I, I mean like, these seem a little bit greedy. At least you can cast this guy, but still. Oh god, they're just going to searing blaze, oh, for fuck's sake. Guess we're going to three. <sighs> Come on. To get me through this, send me charm kind of life. How do I feel about islands? Generally, I like them a lot. Red cap raid. Is this gonna get menace? Lock. This guy doesn't get trample though, right? Each attacking non-human gains trample. So let's do this and take none. Hey, found another black land. Okay. So I like Charm Sleep and Tomb Raider here. They have to be the only three swamps in the deck, right? I mean, we could play Clackbridge Troll. Well, I mean, obviously we're blocking again. Do you have a third barge in? That'd be impressive. No, we're just trading? Okay, that seems great. <clears throat> what just happened? Uh... Wait, what just happened? 
Oh, the Order of Midnight to get their guy back? That's pretty good. So we know one of their cards is Dwarf. If there's a land on top, we can play this. That's actually pretty good. I was watching an old Amica draft on the old YouTubes and you lost there. Not Mike asked what we do. What do we do now? Hit ourselves with hammers. All I could think of was wait two years. What does that mean? Forever Young, they put back... Yep, Order seems pretty good. They have no other creatures in their graveyard, so they just have to cast it as a 2-2. Two -two. So they can just play double 2-2s? Two oh, yeah. The <laughs> this wasn't a claw hammer, this was a regular hammer. A claw hammer is something totally different, right? It is a claw hammer. Why are they called that? I thought it was just a regular hammer. Huh. Returns Lock Dragon. Oh, they can bounce the other cards. That's right. Yeah, that makes sense. I forgot that. I forgot, the, I forgot, the, I forgot these are creatures for a second because they've had no like real, <clears throat> no real relevance this game. They're like, I'm never gonna, never gonna sacrifice a thing. Never gonna give you up. Never gonna let you down. So the other hand is still... Dragon, which they can't cast, and Dwarf. Well, you see. Oh, God. Listen to condescending Josh over here. Are they attacking with this goat? I mean, I'm just going to block here. Interesting. Okay, there's one dwarf. And I feel like if you had more things to play, you would have played them by now. Nope, guess not. Oh, yes, that guy. How could I forget? Oh, that's pretty nice. So they're going to four here? That's crazy. So we can block two of these. Um. Hmm. All right. As long as we, if they draw nothing, we're in great shape.
we're gonna get? Who we're gonna get? Let's block two 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 one. One to one. Wow. Oh no. <laughs> oh, that was like four minutes ago. That was a while ago. Almost sorry, for Josh. I know you better than that, buddy. Oh wow, a second, a second. Re that guy can't block. And any creature that dies, just okay. So they're dead then, right? So whenever another creature dies, okay. So, so even if they sack a thing, they die. Yeah, that's pretty good. Wow, this game was nuts. And done. <laughs> All right. Wow, sweet combo. Runaway train never coming back. Psychic creature and then you die. Uh, I don't know if I want to board anything in here. I don't really care. Lost Legion might actually be better than Tome Raider here. Two threes block their two ones and two twos all day. Hmm. Let's take out a Frogify. I will keep this hand. I don't think they were going to position at any point. I was going to the store for Mountain Dew. My wife said I was addicted. I didn't go to the store. Now I'm... <laughs> this is quite the roller coaster, man. Coming back. Well, dang it. Ugh. Watch this witch's cottage bite us in the ass here. Do you miss playing competitively? Not even a little bit. I the only thing I miss about playing competitively is the exposure is getting my name out there having a wider audience because I play competitively stuff like that that's the only thing I miss if I could do that without playing competitively 100% would 5, 6, 8, 9, 10 that's a lot of damage man 
Oh boy. Yikes. Would you ever be a caster? Yeah, 100%. I love casting, and it's what I would love to do on a more regular basis. One, two, three, five, six, seven, eight, and ten. I guess we're dead here. Unless we bake this dude into a delicious biscuit. Was it that bad? Do you mind explaining? I mean, it's just it's just grindy and exhausting. Like, I could either sit in my house and stream on the weekend. Uh, I could be in, like, gym shorts. I can get food and drink whenever I want to. Or I can fly to an event Friday night. I can pay $200 to $300 for a ticket. I can pay a $60 entry fee. I can make sure I have my deck. I can wake up at 8 a.m. to be there for the round one. I can play until 10 p.m. Hope I can get some food. Hope that not everything is closed by the time we get done. Um, and then I can do it all the next day. And that's if I day two. If I don't. And then like Sunday night, I'm either flying out Sunday night yikes I, I fly out sunday night and then I, I like have to like rush from the convention center with my luggage because I, I checked out sunday morning so i'm rushing to the convention center i'm like i'm rushing to the airport from the convention center uh when i get done with whatever i get done with if i end up playing later i have to uh i have to maybe change my flight until monday morning which means i probably miss some amount of streaming or you know i just want to recover this is uh, like you know and i have to write an article monday night so that's a rough too and like um, and then, like, if you don't day two, this is all. This is all hoping that you day two and do well. And if you don't, then you just get to hang out for the rest of the weekend, play drafts that are overpriced. Like, I don't know. It's just, it's not an ideal. Like, I just don't enjoy the lifestyle. Really, like, it's just not fun for me. I, I'd much rather be here chatting with you guys, uh, playing on Twitch. And playing Magic Online, I like. I got up in the middle of a, of, of a draft and refilled my drink, and now I have a drink, and I'm wearing like gym shorts, and you know, it's just this is just, yeah. I get I get exhausted after one day of a GP. It's totally reasonable too because you play Magic for like ten hours straight, and uh, it's not a realistic amount of time. Like it's an exhausting amount of time. So like if we play Sir Conrad, we just die because we block this guy. We almost have to play Hypnotic Sprite as a blocker and then keep up Runaway slash Food Token. Have you played Outer Worlds yet? Well, if you follow me on YouTube or if you follow my public page on Facebook, uh, you would know that I not only played Outer Worlds, I've been streaming it, and the first part went up tonight at 9 p.m. So to answer your question, Bobby Miser, yes. Yes, I do. Hold on one second, guys. Moving this over here. Okay, so you're bouncing this guy. Which means they're dead, right? Because they can we bounce one of these guys, they just equip the other. Yeah, that was a little rough. Runaway train of coming back. Okay. I mean, this guy's actually tempting to bring in. It's not great, but it's an o it's an O three that blocks everything. So, uh, maybe Sir Conrad can come out. <laughs> Bobby Miser, no worries, buddy. No worries. Um, let me go to. I have to re-add these commands. Add com discord. Okay, discord is good. Deck critique is good.
Thank you. <gasps> Jojo MK, thank you so much for the resub. Really appreciate it, buddy. Can't wait till the new cube comes out and then we can draft angels, swords, titans, or whatever, whatever may come about. You are awesome. Thank you so much, lady. Really appreciate it. I have to re-add all these commands because um, MTG, MTG bot died. And all the commands were lost. So now I'm doing it manually. Like a sucker. Oh yeah, keeping this hand for sure. This is the hand we've always dreamed of. Oh yes. Look at this little weasel. We played one time in Ixalan, I think. I F6 through a negate and you cast the cobbled wings and flew over the top of me. What has been your favorite card to? Oh god, the suspense to draft in in the in cube or in general. Oh, that's a big question. Wow, that's a crazy question. This is the guy who bought your full oof. Thanks again. Hey Drake, thanks so much, man. Really appreciate it. Glad it got to you safe and sound. Use it wisely. Shut down lots of. Uh... Lots of astrolabes. Um, my favorite card to draft in Eldraine. Ooh, that's a good one. I mean, I kind of want to say a rare. Like, it's Worthy Knight has been awesome. Every time I feel like I draft Worthy Knight, it's always very good. Anybody can do a fifty dollars donation for a deck? Yeah, for sure. Like, that's uh, that's always been a thing. I mean, I I, I only charge fifty because like it keeps me from like having to do a million of them, right? Like, if you guys can't do 50, that's totally fine. I understand, and I would I would easily uh, alter the deal. You know, but... Who are we blocking here? Let's block... I'm gonna block the Weasel, because I think, like... This guy's always a 2-2. Two -two. This guy gets harder to block at a certain point. Pray I don't alter it further. That's true. I'm scared if I submit a non Oko deck, it's just going to be garbage. You, are you talking about standard? I think we just keep up baked no pie, then drop this clack bridge troll like it's hot. They have the mono island, the mono mountains right now, which is pretty insane. Honestly, TPO, I would also be afraid of that. I hate to say it, because I feel like by saying it, I'm kind of limiting my own, uh, be the Rampart Smasher. Oh, this guy. Look at this guy. That's fine. I'll just kill him all the same. Sometimes you bake that dude into a pie. Definitely coming at you here. Come on. Let's do it. Three life and a card? What's it going to be? Oh, three life and a card it is. All right. My Grixis Adventures has a 65% six, win rate against O'Connor. That's crazy. That's a sizable win rate, my friend. When you play Brazen Barber, Murderous Rider, and Bone Crusher Giant with Lucky Clover, you've got good weapons against O'Connor. Yeah, maybe that's true. What if you don't hit your... 
your lucky charm though did you see the new Mandalorian trailer that released tonight? No, because I was streaming. And yes, I signed up for Disney Plus and I signed up for the three year deal where they where you get it for like four dollars a month. So I already spent my hundred and twenty dollars on on Disney Plus for the next few years. This guy's just impossible to beat, right? Like get in there. Disney Plus looks insane. When I saw the list of things that were gonna be on there, this is after I already subscribed. I saw that they released a list of, of, of shows and movies that were going to be on there from the beginning. Not even the cool shit that's coming out later, like She-Hulk, Moon Knight, uh, Captain Mar uh, Miss Marvel, like all the other Disney, all the other Marvel shows that I'm super hyped for. Um, I felt like I was stealing from them. I was like, I feel like I'm just stealing. Like, $4 a month is insane for three years. You mean Team Pump and Sutz viewers 2020? <laughs> I don't even know what that is, so I'm just going to assume it's a Disney show. Oh, God, because of course it is. Poppin' Sons. Hmm. Well. Might as well use it. Use it or lose it, that's what I always say. Is it a movie? Poppin' Sons? Brink, you uncultured heathen? What's happening right now? I'm really confused about everything that's going on in the chat right now. It's a Disney rollerblading movie? Is it animated? Is it about pups and sons? I'm just going to block here because it gives you one less creature to sacrifice. And I don't care about Tome Raider to be quite honest with you. Brink is a 19... Oh. Oh, the movie is called Brink. Oh, all right. This is all making a lot more sense now. Their team name is Pup and Suds. Wow. This is... This is all making sense now, guys. I really appreciate the effort you've put in to really, to really teach me things that I needed to learn that I didn't know I needed to learn. <sighs> Look at that big ass dwarf. Ready to wait for you. These days are Tap that goat. Tap that goat. We're blocking here. Big ass dwarf does feel like it. Look at that big ass dwarf. I mean, comparatively speaking, you know, when it comes to dwarves, like, oh, I see. That's, that's, mm, that's rough. I guess we're taking five. It's almost better to just bounce this guy, right? It is better now. Because now we take four instead of five, so that's fine. All right, well, you have to actually sack a thing now, so we're going back up to 13, which is super nice. Goodbye, little quote, quote, little quote. Okay. Let's take a gander and see what we got here. I just realized that tomorrow is my Friday because it's six six day weekend. That was my last goat. 
Oh my god, I don't know why that was so funny. Hey, I want you to know something. That was my last goat. I, mean, I feel like we can just play Hypnotic Sprite. Easily block here, block here. This guy get Menace? No, he gets Trample. Okay, that's pretty good. They have one card, we have like four cards. And this fat daddy. True story, I had a goat when I was younger. She died giving birth, her name was Nanny. Oh my god. That's the saddest story ever. I don't care about either of these. They could be fine though. I'll just keep the Vandal, I guess. I don't even know. I don't care. They're both going on the bottom. Whatever. I'm just going to sleep this guy. We got sleeps for days. What up, MTG Fuzzy 2 Wuzzy? Got him. <sighs> All right, well, this guy's an easy sack, so peace out. Play you for two. Play this witch. And we're good to go. Oko is no Joko. May we meet again before too long, my friend. Just this guy. I want that thank troll to do the final do the final deed. Rojo, thank you so much for the for the sub. Really appreciate it. Welcome, welcome. Are we 4 0 right now? Well, 4 2, I guess, but we're still 2 0. I like it. I like it. These days are all singing free. Why do I have the Happy Days song stuck in my head? Is anybody? Is anybody now? You know what? I'll keep this hand. It's incredibly risky, but we're on the play. If we can hit two lands, I think we're just in great shape. Because you're just so happy. Days. Maybe that's true. Oh, boy. I think we're just holding up. Holding up this guy. Then we can bake. Then we can run away together. The Fonz is always with you. May the Fonz be with you. And I'm with the Fonz. I'm going to pass here because they could play a 3-drop, which lets us play Hypnotic Sprite. And if they don't, then we can just play Queen of Ice. Oh, yes. This is going to be a good one. I'm excited about it. Something something exciting is happening. Yeah, that's fine. The value. Never did not have it always. It's true. It's true. All 
Oh, that guy's a real scumbag. Oh, he ain't that bad, though. Come on, Black Source. That's fine. That's sad, but that's still fine. Black Source. Swamp! It was not a swamp. Long time YouTube lurker, living the Twitch Prime dream. Thank you so much, dude. I really appreciate it. If you guys have Twitch Prime, you can feel free to get a free subscription every month through through Twitch Prime. So here's the question. Do we clack bridge troll? I don't think so. I think we gotta kill this dude. In some way, shape, or form. Could frogify him, but that doesn't let us play anything else. I think we're just gonna bake that dude into a sweet, sweet pie. And then we'll be bait we'll be clack bridging. Oh man, if my opponent does have Archon, that would be such beats. He'd be like, hey man, here's three goats. And they're like, you mean three three threes? Look at this Flutter Fox. I cried a little, I would also cry a little. Did Thwok make fun of you? I would. If I was Thwok, I would have been like, you stupid dummy. No, just kidding. I wouldn't do that. You're a good friend. Can you stop playing things? That's all I want you to do. I think so. We are brothers. <laughs> yeah, that makes sense. I mean, if I was... If I had a brother, I would make fun of him. I'd be like, look at you, you stupid idiot. And he's like, I'm just eating cereal. And I'd be like, exactly. Hmm. I'd be like, way to eat cereal like a dummy. These flyers are getting obnoxious. We can get rid of this though. Ooh, wait, what's that? What's that? We're playing a black blue deck. There's no way to get rid of that. Okay, well that's unfortunate. So what do we got here? One, two, three, four, five, six damage. Yep, we're basically dead. Hey, you can't call me Hank Lepore, your brother, a dummy. Oh, dang it. But what if I could? Think about it. Think about it. I guess we're not dead. We have a food. God, this Clackbridge troll has really been like. Don't turn around. Uh oh. The Clackbridge Trolls in town. Uh oh. I thought your name was Chris McGee. I'm so confused. <laughs> oh god, he has so many names. Oh, we gained it. Oh, yes. Excellent. I mean, you can only, we can't block five of this, so that's fine. Oh yeah, block with that goat. Goaty boys, it'll burn your throat. I mean, I guess we're just taking five, going to four. We can crack this food, go back to seven. Tomb Raider block something. I feel like we're in okay shape here. Oh no. Okay, so just the floaty boys. Well, them floaty boys are at it again. We can also play and equip this next turn and then still, like, crack the food. Crack that food! A lot of pressure here, guys. A lot of pressure. Oh, wow. 
this is some kind of serious aggression. That didn't seem very hard to do. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Crack that whip. Hmm. Let's bounce you and the Flutter Fox, I guess. That saves us two damage. We're cracking this just gains us three. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I guess we'll just take eight here. <laughs> Go to one. And they're going to play Ardenville Tactician. Sure. I mean, they kind of have to tap something, right? That okay, guy's not doing it. Oh, wow. Sure. Oh, we'd have to do one more. Oh, alright, cool. That was... Land. Uh, keep... Play this... block and bounce and we go to one correct that whip yep block here okay Bounce and block. Take three. Play your fox again. No? Playing Resolute Rider, sure. I don't even know what's going on in the chat right now. I'm just trying to survive. pretty good uh no attacks bottom you top you I just want the lands at this juncture so we have no way to block these three creatures we actually have to charm sleep one of them I guess we could play Tome Raider, hit a land, and then do nothing else with that land. Oh, I think we're dead, right? Because we have three blockers, so we're going to take three creatures are going to get through unblocked. I guess we'll find out. We'll see what they do. Yeah, I think we're dead. That sucks. Yep, they figured it out because they are so smart. Ah, 
unfortunate. Again, Lost Legion seems good. Griffin actually seems fine against their flyers. I think we'll be all right. Yep, I'll keep this hand. We're not dead yet. Hmm. Well, that's no bueno. Alright, well next turn we have two five drops, which is super nice. If we hit a land, we can actually get rid of one of the lands. Play Sage of the Falls. You're missing all these outdated pop culture references for what, some dumb draft? Yeah, that's fair. Now they're going to play Resolute Rider. I'm going to frogify that dude as soon as possible. But for now, we're just going to play this. Because it survives all the things. Get rid of Witch's Cottage. Oh, that's a good one. That's also a good one. Wow. How nice. Really? Sure. Here's plus two, plus two. Yeah, sounds good. Oh boy, this deck is good. I can see why we're losing to it. Yikes. <laughs> Four, five, six, seven, eight. Got it. And dead. All right. Two, two, one. Not too bad. I'll deal with it. I accept it. We've had some pretty good luck in drafts so far. So I think we have still like eight packs. So I'm pretty okay with that. Thank you guys for watching. Check me out on patreon.com slash Frank Lepore. It's a great way to follow for like a dollar a month if you guys don't have a ton to spend on subscriptions. A dollar or two dollars a month on patreon.com slash Frank Lepore is a great way to support the channel. And the YouTube.com slash Frank Lepore content as well, which goes up every single day. Uh, you guys can also check me out at CoolStuffInc.com every Wednesday for new articles. 
Thank you for watching. Slam those like and subscribe buttons, guys. I will see you next time.